Okay, here we go. So we open the box. First thing we see is the NJSJ unhappy or happy. It looks like one of these um, uh, share your experience type of thing. And uh, it gets some extended warranty. It says six month warranty. Extra on this. Um, you already have 24 months product warranty on it. So, you know, you just scan these codes right here. Um, and yeah. Alright, and then what else we have? Looks like a quick start manual. Or maybe the whole manual. You don't really need anything special in terms of intelligence to really hook this up. It's pretty much clear cut. Um, looks like it so you do have 30 day return for any reason 24 month warranty lifetime technical support um yeah rgb lighting fix up six modes which the six mode is off so I mean, yeah just letting y'all know um this is usb plug for power not for using actual uh, device itself so you can't just plug this in with USB and be done with it you have to actually have also a aux uh, input you have four eighth, uh, one eighth from jack input All right um, these say they're 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz but I know it's not uh, you can't be especially for the size and the power but from what I hear these, these this uh, model of speaker is pretty good in quality of sound. And it's a Bluetooth as, um, as well, so you don't have to hook it up on aux cord. You can just Bluetooth in. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and open it. We're going to pull this little plastic piece right off. Expose the speakers. And go ahead and pull them out. So this is their pre-wired. Alright, so you get speakers and nothing else in the box. Alright, speakers. In plastic. Turn them around. This is your connection. One goes into power. The other one is your auxiliary send. They are powered together. You can't disconnect these, even though they're supposed to be Bluetooth. It is five watts times two. It's a total of 10 watts. Um, let's go ahead and take these out the bag. Back at the bottom, pull them out. Expect, let's check this one out. Okay, so you got your volume button. I mean, uh, volume knob right here. Looks like a um, headphone jack for output. The grill looks nice. Um, metal on that part, but plastic right here. Does have vent holes, so more sound can come out. This is right here is supposed to be a touch to change your color or your RGB. All right? And does it say which side is which? No, it does not. Looks like it has some anti-skid. Uh, I mean, um, plastic underneath, exposing a. I believe it's a. No, it's not that sticky. Anti-skid. That's all it is. Alright. Let's go ahead and figure out which one's left and which one's right real quick.
does not say. We're gonna assume. Sorry about that. We're gonna assume that this is gonna be your right, and the other one is gonna be your left. Hey guys, pop this one out. Plastic aside. Don't kill the dolphins. Okay, so we're gonna grab the speaker wire. And go ahead and unravel this. For now, so I can reach my destination to give you guys sound. Alright, pull this out. So, it's kind of a little tangled. All right, let me, let me see real quick. So the distance between both speakers, the wire itself, it goes pretty long, about five feet in each direction. So you can set them a little different, uh, far apart, right? Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and plug this one into my cell phone, so. You guys can ask it here. You plug it in. And immediately you see the color of the speakers. That's it. 